Yeah, this was a very important project for us. We started talking uh, about uh, uh, something uh, uh, that can we uh, that, that we can do together with IK almost a couple of years ago. Uh, and uh, during the last months, uh, uh, we worked very hard with them to to bring uh, this one uh, to today to the Super Bowl. Uh, we actually been involved since the beginning, and we. Uh, we, we, we took their specification and their uh, user interface, uh, uh, very interesting uh, uh, concept uh, to be fo uh, focused on the electronic part of the design. So we designed the, 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 the oscillator, the filter, and all the microcontroller system that drives all the control voltages. Uh, we have to remember that it's a fully programmable analog synthesizer, so it has all the control points of a normal synthesizer but digitalized and then uh, you have to generate all the signal but you also have to take care of the user interface uh, you have to take care of the usb communication there are a lot of uh, things that, uh, that the internal intelligence have to do uh, we took care of that and we took care of the analog generation of signal and uh, with them and with their instrumentation uh, we did uh, all the fine tuning about uh, the response of the envelopes the filter sound and a lot of uh, a lot of stuff uh, the specification were very uh, demanding in terms of sound in terms of function for a machine this uh, uh, small uh, and uh, with the price point uh, that uh, we had in mind since the beginning. So it has been a, uh, a, really, a really wonderful project, a difficult project, and uh, we are really proud to be part of this uh, uh, big news in the world of analog synthesizers. And uh, obviously this will be only the beginning, I guess, of, of, of uh, this one. And. Uh, yeah, uh, we are also proud that this is an all Italian stuff. You know, Italy has a big uh, tradition in synthesizers that basically in the 80s, up from the 60s to the 80s, we, uh, you know, Farfisa, Elka, Trumar, all, all of these big, uh, big players basically disappeared uh, at the end of the 80s. Uh, I guess and I hope this is a renaissance for this uh, kind of activity. Uh, it is also manufactured in Italy, so this is also, yeah, this is also a big, a big uh, information for the for the customer. So we are, uh, yeah, really proud to have worked with the IK on this stuff. Basically, the the, the VCO design uh, is similar to the to the modular VCO design. Uh, obviously, it's much more refined. It uses different uh, scalings for the control voltages because everything is scaled down to smaller voltages. Uh, but it's basically a yeah, traditional uh, relaxation oscillator with, with, a, with a sawtooth core. Uh, then the classic wave shape supply. Uh, one uh, new one uh, new application of uh, com electronic component is the continuously variable wave shapes of the oscillator. Uh, we use mixer ICs uh, that are uh, really really powerful and allows you to have uh, all the in between shapes. Uh, the interesting thing is that you can control these in between shapes. For example, with the LFO sync to the MIDI, and so you can obtain something that resembles the, the, you know, the West Coast way shaping. So it's not just a matter of filter that is very good sounding actually, but you can also do modulation and change in uh, in, uh, in spectrum of the sound just by modulating the two VCO uh, independently. So this is another important stuff. The two VCO are completely independent, also with regard to the wave shaping and wave forming. So uh, this is for sure uh, a, a peculiarity of this machine. Uh, the filter, on the other hand, is a well-proven design. is a is a is a multi-mode filter. Uh, it has a very interesting high-pass characteristic. 
uh, we modified slightly and we use this new component also for the resonance feedback so uh, it gets a character on on some part of the of the circuit that uh, reflects on the sound so it starts from a very traditional synth architecture but it's uh, it's uh, filled with uh, very high performance uh, function regarding the sequencer, regarding the automation. You can automate during the sequence all the parameters. And this is not uh, a trivial task to do. And so, yeah, these are the main uh, aspects of the, of the machine with regards to the, yeah, to the electronic part.